22 years ago, on the 2nd of November 2000, one astronaut and two cosmonauts opened the door to the newly constructed International Space Station and floated in. It was the beginning of more than two decades of humans permanently living and working aboard the orbiting outpost. This space station has allowed astronauts and the ISS to conduct more than 3,000 science experiments. Astronauts aboard the International Space Station have conducted science in a way that cannot be done anywhere else. It's unparalleled. Orbiting about 250 miles above our planet, the space station has supported numerous discoveries, scientific publications, unique opportunities, and historic breakthroughs. It is valuable research that not only helps us explore farther into space, but also benefits us back on Earth. But, despite all these factors that make it an invaluable resource, the International Space Station is not without its share of controversies. Some political, some technical, and some bizarre and otherworldly. Today, we're going to take a look at some of the biggest controversies and conspiracy theories about the ISS. Orbit Beyond the Blue The size of a football field and hurtling through space at 17,500 miles per hour. The station has been a symbol of collaboration through wars and turmoil, and is, to many in the space community, worthy of a Nobel Peace Prize to recognize it as the largest international peacetime endeavor in human history. But there's the bizarre conspiracy theories about unidentified objects spotted from the ISS. The instances are plenty, and the explanations, absent or very few. In 2017, an astronaut aboard the ISS snapped a peculiar image of the Earth, which showed two strange, blue blobs of light floating near Earth. One has to see the image to realize how strange and otherworldly these lights appear. Did we just witness UFOs flying past the International Space Station during its live feed? We will probably never know. But it's undeniable that the age-old fixation on UFOs lurking around Earth spotted from the ISS magnified after the Pentagon released three short clips depicting unidentified aerial phenomena in April 2020. The two videos date back to 2004 and 2015 and show objects flying at high speed that remain unidentifiable till date. A white cylindrical object was seen flying past the ISS on Friday, the same day the space station detected a series of high-speed objects flying nearby. Not too long ago, a report by the Pentagon revealed that while UFO sightings may be confirmed, aliens cannot. It is entirely possible that the strange flying objects seen by US intelligence could be sophisticated tech built by other countries while these aircraft remain unexplained, such proof coming from the ISS or from US documents does answer some questions that remained largely hidden from the general public for decades that aliens may have visited Earth, with or without our knowledge. There's always a possibility that these bizarre unidentified objects are just some space junk or debris floating around, but we will never know for certain. Since the dawn of the space age in the 1950s, we have launched thousands of rockets and sent even more satellites into orbit. Many are still there. As long as humans have been exploring space, we've also been creating a bit of a mess, orbiting our planet are thousands of dead satellites, along with bits of debris from all the rockets we've launched over the years. On September 11, 2017, a vlogger posted footage from the IS Live camera feed, which streams over the web. In his annotated footage, he points out a faint, elongated white shape with a neat row of faint white dots next to it set against the blackness of space just below the curve of the Earth. It is an amazing UFO mothership letting out an orb fleet on ISS Live feed, the vlogger explains in the video title. Has the International Space Station 
inadvertently caught sight of an interstellar space station hovering nearby? Or is the blurry streak filmed out the window of the space station, merely a window reflection? Aliens would be amazing indeed. However, ufologist Mark D'Antonio, chief photo and video analyst for an international organization called the Mutual UFO Network, who has analyzed thousands of ISS photos and videos alleged to contain UFOs, says the faint white marks in this one are a common sight. They are reflections off of the window of the ISS. If you put aside these UFO and UAP conspiracy theories, then there are stories of sabotage and political tensions brewing aboard the space station. The fragile coalition that has kept the space station going all these years is fraying, as tensions between Russia and the United States, the two main partners on the station, grow to levels not seen in the previous years of the space station. And while the countries have kept their alliance on the station going despite geopolitical tensions, the fence that has kept the station alive is slowly eroding. In 2018, wild theories of sabotage were floating around after a mysterious pressure leak occurred on the International Space Station. NASA and Roscosmos first detected a drop in the space station's pressure around 7 p.m. ET on Wednesday, August 29th, suspecting that there was a leak of some kind on the ISS. The air was escaping at such a slow rate that flight controllers opted not to wake the crew. The next day, the six astronauts on board the ISS traced the leak to a small hole inside one of the two Russian Soyuz capsules docked to the space station the vehicles used to bring crew to and from Earth. The hole was successfully patched up on Thursday, August 30th, but the mystery over the origin of the hole has remained. While the mystery of the hole was never completely solved, tensions still remain strife between the two space agencies, with the head of the Russian space agency saying that his country will lend its participation in the International Space Station in 2024 as a multi-nation program that serves as the home of astronauts and cosmonauts. The ISS has made it possible to send humans into space farther than ever before. Essentially, it has given humans a permanent residence in space, something that was earlier only pure science fiction. Like most space programs, ISS is proof of the lengths we will go to in the quest for knowledge. Human beings have been living in space every day since the first crew arrived. The station's laboratories allow crew members to do research that could not be done anywhere else. It is one of the most iconic pieces of space hardware in history, but the days of the International Space Station are now officially numbered. NASA has announced that the curtain will finally fall on the ISS in 2031, that is less than a decade. The football pitch-sized orbit outpost will be decommissioned, brought crashing back to Earth before splashing down in a remote part of the Pacific Ocean. Here's hoping the space station does a lot more research and exploring before curtains close. Beyond the Blue